Good morning. Now uh, I'm gonna show you the picture of dark room. This is the wet area and this is the dry area. And as you see, it they are separated. And now what we're going to do is we going to discuss the dry area and wet area why it is separated. So now we proceed. So these two are the separate work areas this is the one dry area and the wet area the one practical reason why in dark room design has a table or countertop along one wall for the enlarger trimming board and paper supplies this is the dry area as you see in picture um makikita mo yung mga papers yung nilagyan nila are very safety so kailangan nilang lagay sa cabinet for para um, hindi sila mabasa or um, para maingatan and, and the another countertop or table along this is the opposite wall for prints processing trace and prefer preferably a sink this is the wet side kung saan sila process for mixture um, this separation is effective in preventing damage um, to the enlarger, timer, film, and paper supplies for splash or spilled liquids. Um, kaya kailangan nilang maging separated kasi um, in mixture, kapag nagpa-process na sila ng film, ay kailangan nilang um, ingatan yung pag-work nila kasi um, yung mga gamit ng in, uh, dry surface is very sensitive and kailangan nila yung um, separate from the wet side kasi um, this wet side dito nila ginagamit yung mga halos basa from the term liquid um, kasi kapag magmi-mixture na sila um, hindi mo naman masahan na baka may biglang tumalsik sa sa mga wet wet yung mga yung mga dry na yung mga dry materials so kapag nabasa sila um, pwedeng hindi mo na sila magamit and kailangan din sa pag-work is mas malawak dapat yung work surface ng dry area kasi uh, dito na kung saan magpa-process ng film yung makikita mo uh, kung gaano maging kaingat yung mga nag-work kasi very sensitive yung paggawa ng film dahil yung mga materials nila is um, medyo mamahalin kaya kailangan nilang maging and that's all thank you for listening